Hello everyone, in this session we are going to discuss about MATLAB programming for bioengineers part 2 so sequential analysis for example, for example by using a MATLAB bioinformatic toolbox having a sequence analyzer sequence weaver app by using this sequence weaver app you can explore your protein sequence using uh, this special type of app sequence weaver app the sequence weaver, uh, weaver integrates many of the sequence functions in the bioinformatic toolbox Instead of entering commands in the MATLAB command window, we can select and enter options using this app. Now we are, we are going to see some viewing amino acid uh, sequence statistics. Now in command window, just you type sequence viewer. You will get bio, bio, biological sequence viewer app. Uh, by using this you can uh, uh, import from workspace also there by you can see uh, you, if you want to uh, view the sequence of uh, it may be pro amino acid it may be protein uh, import your database or download sequence from ncba or uh, mbl database now uh, we are seeing with some examples uh, for example let's uh, explore a protein sequence using this app. now you see, see the matlab in file it's called explore a protein sequence using sequencer app here overview of uh, sequencer app this sequencer we were integrates many of the sequence functions in the matlab toolbox instead of entering commands in the matlab command window you can select and enter options using this app for example the following procedures just you uh, you see how to view an amino acid sequence or how to view the nuclear or protein sequence download, download from uh, more number of database of uh, database available here the following procedure uh, uh, illustrates how to view an amino acid sequence for an ORF uh, located in a nucleotide sequence. We can uh, import uh, your own amino acid sequence or you can get a protein sequence from GenBank database. This example shows us the GenBank assertion number, this uh, assertion number NP uh, 0051.1, which is an alpha uh, subunit for human enzyme associated with. Test uh, exists. Uh, for example, now you see with uh, how to download the sequence from NCBA database, and also you enter the how to enter the sequence. If you enter the uh, after reading this uh, sequence here, we 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 are getting the uh, biological sequence we uh, we were app like this. Now, uh, from what you what you do is for go to file download sequence from ncba download the sequence from ncba dialog box is open this dialog box will be open i am uh, you can enter the sequence in this box and the sequence accession number or locus name here you can select it it is nuclear data it is protein now for, for example you are seeing the protein uh, sequence uh, now you type np underscore triple zero five eleven point one this is a click the protein, protein option and then click ok now uh, the sequence we were access the NCBA database on the web and loads amino acid sequence information for the accession number what you enter like this then afterwards we can display amino acid color scheme, color scheme also and then uh, select charge function here you can see uh, select the charge functions uh, also available here charge function I am hydrophobicity VCT and structure or trailer or for example uh, function this uh, displays colors uh, change to highlight the uh, charge information about the amino acid residues this following table shows the color legends for the amino acid schemes now we can uh, let's see how to get from web can first you download sequence from NCBA database just you select now I choose this uh, sequence accession number. It is protein, so I selected protein. It takes some more time to download the particular skin. Now uh, it's downloaded. Now uh, we are we got the the accession number corresponding accession number XO some dash and pre uh, pro protein. There is a Homo sapiens. Here we can see what is the amino acid count A and B and is there, is there, is there. And then features also there. Here what is the, this is the sequence of this corresponding association uh, number. This is features. What is the source and protein? 
these are the degrees available here here this is a command this is a locus and number and keywords references of this and where it is taken and title of this also is available here now we can so see the a lot of options are available here this is the now is, is you can get the genetic plot and protein plot this is a protein plot is available here you can see the graph for this one you can see there are buried residues, accessible residues and alpha helix there are uh, show face man and uh, some more uh, sequence other also you can see the amino acid composition in within the second we can analyze the sequence there is uh, no uh, no programming knowledge no knowledge about uh, matlab any biomedical engineers you can see the uh, plot protein plot for more, more number of properties here you can see spltc and and uh, what do you what do you want hydro obesity here open woods method and gay gay method genin method here more you can also see the uh, molecular weight weight diagram uh, these things are available with this uh, uh, interactive sequence viewer app in uh, matlab bioinformatic toolbox tfa retentions and all things all the things are here also you can import the sequence from workspace also there for example we are uh, we are uh, uh, another protein not from your uh, database I N C B I or any uh, any other gen bank you can also import from workspace also there is a protein plot here this is a scholar scheme also there the sequence also you can use by using this one three letter code you can also you can modify amino acid residue here also so many options are available to display nucleotide color scheme and amino acid color scheme and amino acid residue display in this manner also you can get you can see this one in this manner we can see the display colors changes to highlight the charge information about amino acid is received the also we can use this app we can plot the graph plot the protein plot you can analyze you can see you can just select the genetic code you, you can use find word options also available here Okay, by using this sequence we are up in my informatic toolbox you can analyze any number of nucleotide any any nucleotide or protein sequence by using this interactive app thank you next session we are going to discuss about uh, in sequential analysis of the uh, human uh, immunodeficiency Thank you.